Welcome back to another online drummer.com Monday drum lesson. I'm Nate Brown. In this drum lesson, we're going to go over The Pretender by the Foo Fighters. And if you've been following our Name That Groove Friday trivia, you'll know that The Pretender was the answer to this week's trivia. Thanks to Steve Lee, we now have the full sheet music uh, for The Pretender available on online drummer.com. And for this lesson, I've provided an excerpt of the part that we're going to be going over. Check out Chart Topping Drum Fills, the 60s through today, and Chart Topping Drum Beats, the 60s through today. They're both available as an instant download as well as paperback. And they both have video course companions that go along with them, also available for instant download. Let's get into the Pretender, starting at measure 106, or the first thing written on the excerpt. 106, pretty simple. Uh, we've got the bass drum on two and four. One, two, three, four. And then Steve included a play seven in a zigzag line. Uh, that just means to play that seven times. With drum sheet music, it's nice to have as few pages as possible. And by writing it this way, we can uh, fit all the music on the stand. A common way to count that so you can keep track of where you are is just by changing the first number of the count to the number of the repeat you're on. So like this, one, two, three, four, two, two, three, four, three, two, three, four, four, two. When you get past that play seven, the low tom kicks in with an alternating uh, accent stroke, regular stroke. And the bass drum's gonna play four on the floor. So all those accented strokes are gonna have the bass drum with it. And that's gonna be pretty fast. If you can't play it that fast yet, just keep working on it and you'll get it eventually. You know, it might take a week, it might take a month, but once you get it, it's really going to help you any other time that you have to learn something that, that plays it fast. When you get down to measure 118, the hi-hat kicks in on two and four, and that's going to be played with the left stick. One and two and three and four. And make that a loose, a loose hi-hat. You keep this accent pattern going on the low tom. And you'll notice that I'm not hitting the top of the cymbal with the tip of the stick. I'm hitting the edge of the cymbal with the shoulder of the stick. And it's going to be fast. At measure 122, we kick in with the snare drum on count three. So your left stick's going to be moving back and forth there. One and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and And up to speed. Coming out of that into measure 126, we've got a groove, loose hi-hat, just quarter notes on the loose hi-hat and the bass drum's filling in those eighth notes. Make sure you get good timing with that because we're coming out of this groove here, two and three and four and one and two and three. That bass drum has to be filling in those eighth notes at that same tempo, one and two and three and four and one and two and three and four and one and two. And we'll take a quick look at measure 129. That's the end of that line there. One and two and three and four and a one. One and two and three and four and a one. And the sticking on four I like to do. Four and a, uh, so two left on the snare. Four and a, uh, and then one is the right. Four and a uh, one. I'll put this whole thing together for you at regular tempo. Hope you enjoyed this week's lesson and have fun with the Pretender. It was a quick lesson, but, uh, you know, the concepts are easy to understand. It's the speed that makes it difficult. This Wednesday, uh, Patrick Marsapoil is out on vacation, so we won't have a drum lesson, but Thursday we'll have a lesson by Alex Ribchester. Make sure you check that out. And in the meantime, go to our drum forum at onlinedrummer.com slash forum. We've got a lot of great conversations and people posting videos, all kinds of stuff there. I'll see you next Monday. Keep drumming.